You may have heard the terms clean and dirty bond prices. And these occur, or the difference is, is that one includes accrued interest and one doesn't. So bonds pay interest typically semi-annually, twice a year. So that means if you were to buy a bond between interest payments, you would be entitled to any accrued interest. So when we usually do these calculations in a class, okay, in a finance class or from a textbook, we, we're usually calculating the clean price. We're just looking at the present value of the coupons plus the present value of the face value. Okay? But when you're buying a real bond, you're not necessarily buying it right on that day the coupon will be paid or you know six months before the next coupon is paid, so once one has just been paid. You're usually oftentimes buying it between interest payments. So here we want to calculate the dirty price. So the clean price is the price of a coupon bond not including any accrued interest. The dirty price is the price of a bond that includes accrued interest between coupon payments. So the dirty price is the clean price plus any accrued interest. So how do you figure out the accrued interest? It's really quite simple. You take the face value of the issue and you multiply it by the annual coupon rate divided by the number of coupons per year. So really that's the rate you're getting per period or you're getting per coupon. You then have to adjust it for the time period between or the fraction of a period between the two coupons and that would be the days since the last payment date and then that's divided by the accrued period, the accrual period, number of days between coupon payments. All right, so let's take a look at an example. Suppose a bond pays a coupon rate of 6%. The coupon is paid semi-annually on December 1st and June 1st. And suppose the investor buys the bond on February 1st for a price of $2,000. Let's, uh, let's find the dirty price. So to do that, we need to find the accumulated interest. So this accumulated or accrued interest is $2,000 times 0.06 divided by 2. That is, you're getting 3% uh, interest every 6 months times 62 divided by 182.5. The 62 is the number of days between the last coupon payment, December 1st, and February 1st, and 182.5, that's half a year. So if you work this out, it's $20.38. So the dirty price of the bond, or the investor who buys it on February 1st, would get the $2,000 plus the accrued interest of $20.38. So they would get $2,020.38. So relatively simple to do once you know this um, simple calculation.